do subscribe to ikeda channel and press bell icon to get updates about latest engineering hsc and iit je main and advanced videos hello students today we are studying chapter organisms and environment in that we are studying topic water pollution when i say water pollution it means the water is dirty it contains harmful substance let us study water pollution and find out why and how does it happen water pollution when i talk about water pollution we all have studied in our lower classes that water pollution is nothing but contamination of water bodies when i say water body it could be lakes rivers small ponds or your nearby well which is situated just beside your house how does this water bodies get contaminated what is the reason for their contamination we all know that wherever we stay if there is a water body people in villages particularly wash their utensils they go for bathing purposes in this water bodies which should be clean people put their detergents after washing clothes put their soap or leather in that water bodies many industries such as chemical industries agricultural industries medicinal industries your leather bag industries which emit a lot of dye and coloring agent let out their waste into this water body which further acts up to their concentration levels that is harmful substances get added to this water bodies one of the most harmful substances that is added to water bodies nowadays is mercury oxide or lead we all know that lead is a harmful substance now imagine this lead going inside water bodies this lead will cause bio fortification or you can say it will lead to the death of that particular water body so sometimes directly waste substances are deposited into water bodies and sometimes indirectly waste substances are deposit in water bodies eutrophication the deposition of green algae on the surface of water bodies are some of the common scenes we observe when a water body is dead in india one of the classiest examples of dying water bodies could be the ganga river which is slowly and steadily dying due to certain religious practices and certain industrial practices any death of water body is amalgamation of two forces one is the mankind and another is the industrial source the ganga action plan is slowly and steadily trying to clean the river but it is our bit that we have to do to keep water bodies clean continuously so that future generations could use it water pollution when i talk about water pollution the simple definition for this goes as contamination of water bodies the water body could be lake river ocean even your simple pond now waste substances from industries household that is the waste generated due to cleaning cooking bathing or cattle waste for that matter even human waste is the leading cause of contamination of water bodies in india Water pollution basically occurs due to directly either we dump our household waste directly into the water body or indirectly discharge of harmful waste inside water bodies when i say indirectly discharge it means industrial waste which should be treated and discharged inside water bodies but they never treat the industrial waste and directly discharge the waste in water bodies
whenever improper treatment of water is done this wastewater is added inside water bodies and this wastewater basically contains toxic metals like mercury we all know that mercury is present inside thermometer which is used to check our temperatures this mercury is added inside wastewater even lead let out by certain industries which are chemical industries or pharmaceutical industries which release lead as the waste product is without treatment added to water bodies dye which gives color to our clothes our bags our shoes the byproduct of dye is directly added to water bodies students when all this waste is added inside water body what happens is that that water is not fit for our consumption that is one fact the another fact is that whenever all such waste is added to the water bodies all the flora and fauna when i say flora and fauna it means the plants animals or the sea fishes everything dies slowly and steadily and at one point that particular sea or that particular lake will be dead containing no living organism in itself due to over deposition of waste water i hope you are clear with this concept of water pollution thank you